All right, fellas. We're here. We're here. First spot. We're still getting a little set up here. Um, I'm not starting with this. I'm just dipping something. Oh, okay. You ain't gonna start with Avery? Why not? I'm gonna start with Jerk. Oh, well, that ain't fair. You can't start with one and me start with one too. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, buddy. So we're back at Cumberland, guys. Um, haven't done the intro yet, just due to low light. Um, I think the ones a little midday look a little better. We're gonna see if this thing uh, decides if it wants to work today or not. It will. It will eventually. Um, also, thank thank you guys for the uh, you know the ideas to maybe fix my issue with my trolling motor. I appreciate it a lot. Um, we're definitely looking into trying to get it alleviated maybe purchasing a new one or something but uh just haven't had any time you know it's work it's work season for me so i've been a little busy so we're just kind of dealing with the the current issue that we have but we'll make it through it and i'll eventually either purchase one or something and get back into a better position but we're here we're gonna see if we can catch some fish like i said we made it to the first spot we're starting right where cody broke his pb a couple weeks ago um just i feel like it wouldn't be a bad idea to start here. We saw a lot of fish in the area. As you know, I'm going to have to deal with this for a little bit, but uh, we'll slowly get this trolling motor integrated into one to work again. We'll be able to fish eventually here, but uh, we're going to start on this point, kind of work our way this direction, see if we can hopefully find some big old fish this morning. Please. It always just takes six years to do it. It's just self infuriating. Just the way I have to pull up on a spot just to be able to fish. Like when I get to a lake, it's just annoying. Like you're not allowed to? Yeah. That's a big one. About jerked the rod out of my hand, dude. Oh, it's not that big. That's a decent little smallie, though. He literally about jerked the rod out of my hand. Yeah, well, we pulled up on this point, guys. There's, there's one. Not not too terribly bad. That was like fifth cast. Um, Still don't even have the trolling motor fully operational yet, but he uh, he crushed this uh, jerk bait. Ate it really good. It's fish number one for me, so we're going to get a weight on it. Solid. I'll take that. I uh, will take it. Not a giant, but by all means, solid bass. See you, buddy. When you idle, it's insane. It just makes it so hard to focus on fishing when you're dealing with that problem constantly, man. One. Yeah, good. Feels pretty good. Oh. On the pause again. Yep. He might not be a giant. He ain't know. a giant, ain't netting for you. You got a landing sign. It's in my left. But if it's a big one, I'll net it. It's, it's a, a striper. striper. What I'll, the hell? I'll net it. <laughs> That's a pretty good striper. <laughs> oh, this is my first striper ever. There you go. Congratulations. First buddy. ever. Congratulations. Caught a PB of the wrong species. Really slimy. Uh, no, they're like a bass for the most part. I bet he clobbered it. He fucking did. I thought he fell thawed. I was like, where's the thaw? Kind of just gave up. They fight really hard until they just stop. That's exactly what it was. <laughs> All right, let's let him go. Are you pretty? Is he, can you eat him? You can, but they gotta be a certain size. Yeah. They gotta be like 22 inches long. See, bub. Have you seen the water temp yet? No. Look at the water temp. Oh. 65. Oh. In two weeks, it's dropped like seven, eight degrees, man. That's. I knew it would. It's really good. 
we can get the trolling motor to work today, we might actually catch some fish. Yeah. You hold this for a second. Oh yeah, I got some fish. And I won't eat though. Oh shit. Look at this. The whole head just cracked. That's great. Yeah, I think I just need to buy one. <laughs> Look at the head. Look how it's setting now. Yeah. Uh -oh. Hit it three times. We are dead in the water now, son. What? We're done now. Look at that. Yep, it's done. Are you Cable done? broke. Cable broke. Oh, my well, we're done now. Might as well go home. I was like, what? Well, guys, the cable didn't per se break. The gear in the head of it that you can now see is uh well barely uh even there hanging on at this point is uh it slipped out but i put it back in place obviously we're not going home we just got here but uh it's gonna be a it's gonna be a trying day of learning how to fish with that trolling motor again but we're gonna see what we can do all right guys we're gonna make a move it's gonna be a struggle bus trying to fish today because uh well Y'all can see what's happened here. The gear right here has slipped out once already. So we're probably gonna be using the big motor to move around a lot today, but we're not going home. I'm not gonna allow that to be the thing that stops our day. I think they're gonna eat today. I think we'll have a good day. It's just, it's gonna be difficult with this. I'm gonna have to buy a new one, so. All right, guys. We just pulled up on this point just adjacent to where we just were. I think a lot of today, now with the current predicament we're in it's going to have to be floating with the wind covering a lot of points covering a lot of water that's pretty much just what we're going to have to do i think we'll still catch fish today it's just it's going to be a challenge we're going to have to try to overcome but we'll see what we can get into all right fellas i'm not in the best graces today so you're gonna have to overlook me slightly we're going to try to make the best of the day, make y'all a video, catch a few fish. But uh, the only way we can maneuver the boat now is with the big motor. So you're going to hear a lot of idling in the background for the rest of this video. It's just kind of the hand we have unfortunately been dealt today. So. This just kind of looks good. I figured we'd fish a little bit of it. I could probably idle up and we could drift, but... Might have to do it that way. It does look pretty good. Oh. Oh, we don't need a knife. <laughs> nice. Spotty. Maybe it's a spot. I can't really I tell. It is. Now it's a smallmouth. Ah. Smallie. Cool. Yeah. And there we are, right back at it. Well, doesn't help my day a lot, but it makes me feel slightly better, I guess. Fish number two for me. Yes, I'll take him. Huh? Fish yeah. number two. I can't tell if that's a spot or a smallie, to be honest with y'all. But there he goes. All right, fellas, we've been jumping around. Obviously, we don't have a trolling motor, so we pulled up on something kind of like what we were catching on earlier. And we're going to hopefully, hopefully pull some off of this. It looks really good. I kind of preemptively found this on Google uh, Maps looking at it and stuff. But we, of course, can't effectively fish it as much as we want. But we're going to see if we can catch a few more here off of this, maybe. My line. Hot. 
three to coach zero. I gotta get some honorary credit here. Why is that? Oh. Whopper. Man, he's a whopper, son. That size the one that chased the Ned Rig earlier. Oh, he had to have been bigger than this. No, I'm serious. Yeah. See you, little buddy. Yeah. All righty, fellas. Fish number three of the day. No struggle bus. We're just kind of vibing, just trying to piece together a couple bites. Cody's still yet to catch a bass today. He did catch a striper this morning. That was fun, but uh, that was before all the uh, mayhem ensued. You gonna tell the fine folks what we're doing? Uh, I guess I can. Well, guys, we're at this point. we beached the boat. We're on a big flat. Um, yeah, on purpose. Uh, we might need to specify that. We're just kind of going to look for some baits. The water's like 30 foot low. Uh, oh my God, these are so hard to find. So it's a rare species of black and white drizzled popcorn. I'm done with this bit. I hate my life, dude. <laughs> $20. Really? There you go. No way. Cody found $20 laying on the bank. I'll be a son of a gun. Oh, that's a little better. I got one. You got fish? No, you don't. I really do. No, you don't. I don't believe you. I do. I don't. If you get the net or not, I have a fish. I don't know what the fuck it is, but I got it. I don't think you got a fish. What's that? That's a smallmouth. That's that is, a good smallmouth. That is a big smallmouth. Holy moly. Dylan, this is a giant. There's another one behind us. Three babies. There's two more, Dylan. I'll whip him. I like him off. Did he? He did. Dude, that's your PB. It was. There's another one chasing it, though. No. There was three of them, though, in total. That's like a four. Uh, that was four or five. My goodness, man. I'm gonna go back up there though, because that's. Did you cast parallel to those trees? That's where he came from. I truthfully thought you were joking. No. The whole time. So I'm sorry. That was a big one. No, you're good. Um, just didn't have it the way we wanted to. As you could tell. Finally, holy crap. Hey, it's a spot. I wasn't even looking. I was just like about to adjust something to Cool. Ow. Good job, buddy. The hook spots. Just fine. Yeah, not large or not smallies apparently. Not five pound smallmouth, no. I can tell his teeth are sharp. You gonna wing? Yeah, we're gonna be ow! Time. See, Bubby. Cody's first bass of the day. That's in the boat. Like in the 90s or something? Uh, mid 2000s. That's wild. I would let it spin, but it doesn't do that anymore. It's late. There's one. Oh, look at him. So I put mine up and you did this to me. That's a small. You did it. Almost. I caught a fish on an A-Brig. A-Brig. Uh, up in the street, you know? Yeah. Know that for future reference when I have a trolling motor again. And we can actually fish and live scope and whatnot. Well, that's five fish we've caught today. Good job, us. Yeah, man, I'm glad I could be part of it. All right, boys, we're off the water. Um, you know, it's a pretty bad day. Uh, and that's why I want to upload stuff like this is sheerly the other side, by the way. Um, but uh, sheerly because we all have bad days on the water, guys. Um, absolutely awful day for me. 
I'm out a lot of money. But I can't get discouraged. I gotta come back, fix what needs to be fixed, and get back out on the water and try to figure out what I can do. I am really sad that he lost that big smallmouth. I know he is too. He's Absolutely. It's, it's tearing him up. But uh tough day, man. We didn't get many bites even, you know, with the time we fished and of course I'm once again out of trolling motor. So uh I'm out of commission for a bit, but we'll get it figured out, we'll get it sorted out, and we'll be back on the water before you know it. But please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you.